Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. As you can see today I'm back with a brand new video on Rocket League and today I'm seeing how much my ceiling shots have improved in two years. I believe it was about two years ago where I made a video where I think it was titled Try and Hard Shots in Rocket League Ceiling Shot. So it was sort of like where well, I was fairly new to ceiling shots so today I'm going to be seeing how much better I am at ceiling shots. If you guys want to check out that video I'll leave it at the top of the description. So yeah, if you want to watch that first and then see my improvement. But I think to start with, I'm just going to head straight into free play and just do a couple ceiling shots. Then I might try some training packs or maybe even try and go into a game and hit some ceiling shots. So yeah, let's get straight into it. Okay guys, so from the last time I did it, I have actually practiced ceiling shots a lot and I've gotten a lot better at them. I'm fairly consistent now, you know, I can hit them kind of well. You know, it kind of depends, like, I'd say I get a decent one every now and then. You know, I've never really hit them in game, because my problem is I just don't go for them. Because a lot of the time it's like, it's just more effort than it's actually worth. But yeah, if you guys end up enjoying this video, then consider leaving a like and subscribing for more content just like this. And let me know anything else you'd like to see on Rocket League. And yeah, that was a pretty nice ceiling shot right there. You know, got a little, I mean... Maybe you could say it was like a little bit of an air dribble as well. But yeah, that's definitely probably one of the nicer ones I've had. And I definitely couldn't have hit that two years ago. So definitely clear improvement. But yeah, let me know if I would like to see it on Rocket League or any other games you'd like to see on this channel. And yeah, I'll see. No, no, I won't. Just getting a bit carried away there. You know, going into the outro, you know. But let's see, can we get a decent one here? Oh, didn't actually touch the sea then. Maybe if I try and control it down. I haven't really tried to go for them off the back wall. I feel like maybe until I'm a bit more consistent with it, I'm not going to. Okay, so I'm definitely pretty consistent at doing that where I, I sort of jump off, land on the ceiling and then get a shot off. I feel like the next step for me would be very much try and learn to sort of control the ball a bit more in the air, like I did on that first goal and everything, because that's definitely something that I do need improvement on, because my problem is every time I try and go into control I sort of end up messing it up, yet every time I go to sort of just bang it, it normally does fairly well. Okay, so let's try and go off of this wall, see if we can get anything decent. I can't remember what the training pack was that I did in the previous video because it's been two years. I'm not sure if I've got it saved or not because I can't remember what I recorded that on. I might have recorded it on Xbox because I don't think I was playing PC. For Rocket League at that point, so um, I might not have it in my saved, but I'll see if I can find it in a minute. Or I can maybe just try a couple more in free play, then try that training pack, and then I reckon um, I can go into a normal game. And I might just sort of cut out most of it and just try and show the bits where I go for ceiling shots. Maybe I might try 1v1 because that one will probably be a bit better. And that's another thing, I haven't actually tried it with um, limited boosts. So I've been doing like a fair bit of practicing, I'd say, sort of in between games and stuff. Where I'm sort of practicing, you know, trying to go for ceiling shots and everything in free play. But the problem is with that, obviously, I've got it set to unlimited boost because I feel like that's a pretty decent way just to learn to start with. And then you can sort of get used to boost management afterwards, I feel like. Or at least that's my experience with it. Okay, that was kind of nice. Didn't really get what I was hoping for. But, yeah, I think try one more, then I'll go into a training pack and see how I get on in that. Kind of messed up the setup, but still got a fairly decent shot off. I feel like that's something that wouldn't really work in game. That's why I don't really go for it. Because like, I can hit like ceiling shots fairly consistently. But not ones that are good enough that it would score past opponents. So yeah, let's try and find that training pack and see how we get on. 
Okay, so I actually managed to find the training pack. It was the wall 2 air dribble training pack. And yeah, I mean, I haven't actually tried air dribbles in a while either. So that might be another thing. I might see how much it's improved because I haven't actually been practicing them. So that's definitely going to be something that will be interesting to try. Oh, I tried to get the flick there. This is a fairly decent setup. Oh, I didn't quite get it. I didn't adjust enough in the air. I think that was my problem there. Oh, that was unfortunate. That actually had a decent setup as well. Messed up my drive up the wall. Maybe go for a pinch. But yeah, this was the training pack I used. And it's definitely a pretty decent training pack if you want to start learning. Because like, it's fairly sort of like set up nicely, if you know what I mean. Like this, look at how many I've got that would actually be really decent. Like, I would be happy if I hit in free play. And then sort of, maybe if you want to, transition to free play. I mean, I kind of just started in free play. I didn't really use this training pack at all. I mainly just used it for the video, just to see what it was like. And, yeah, I mean, something you could try. But me personally, I just did it sort of in free play when I was waiting for games. You know, I never really go out my way to sort of practice mechanics or anything. So that's sort of what I did. And then just practicing, getting used to going on the ceiling. And every time I'd score a goal, I'd sort of drive up and try and jump onto the ceiling. Just so I get used to like landing on the ceiling properly. Because that's a lot of it. Like a lot of the learning to do ceiling shots very much came from just learning to land on the ceiling like that without having to potentially like bounce off of it landing awkwardly so you know you take even longer to come down or anything like that problem is it's still taking me a while to come down off the ceiling so that's what's messing me up at the moment I had some pretty nice ones at the start but that's kind of gone downhill I potentially might try and do another one in the original series that I did two years ago where I, would, I think I did two in there. I tried ceiling shots and I tried air dribbling. Potentially I might try and um, do another one of them where I try flip resets and pinches. I was planning on doing it before but I kind of stopped playing fairly consistently after that point. So I was like I'm not really making any improvements. I'm not really good enough to actually hit anything decent so I thought I think for now I'll just leave it whereas now I have actually hit a flip reset in game I've not really hit them at all in training but I ended up hitting one in game gonna be honest it was like kinda by accident I just thought oh why not I'll go for it not actually expecting to hit it and then I did and pinches I mean I was kinda practicing at one point you know became fairly consistent with this training pack I found so maybe I might try and revisit that see how much I've improved but like I said I haven't really been playing a lot over the past like year two years like I've been playing a little bit every season so sort of just maintaining my skill if you know what I mean maybe gaining a little bit I mean that was a nice ceiling pinch but not really what I'm going for I'm trying to get a oh messed that up as promised either I'm going too high it's bouncing off the ceiling I'm taking too long to come off or it's like I get the decent setup and then I mess it up by my flying. That would have been really good had that been on target. Like that's one in a game that you would not want to face. That's another one that's kind of nasty. Like it's not really what you're looking for sort of thing. But in a game that would be hard to defend against because like I'm tapping it away. And then I'm just sort of smacking it on net. So it's not really like a super like looks really good sort of one you're happy to go oh look at this look at what I did and everything but it's still one you think in a game it would be hard to defend against this one's a lot more difficult I'm gonna be honest just because of the setup like it's getting it off onto the ceiling without then bouncing it too high or like doing that where it's coming like sort of too far off okay this might be a decent setup not quite I'm definitely a lot more consistent because last time I don't even think I could get to the point I'm getting to. Like I can consistently get to this point where I'm coming off the ceiling and everything. It's just the finishing that I need to work on. But you know, it all comes with time. 
I reckon potentially I'll see if I can just get one sort of on target here. And I'll try the other one, which I think was another weird one. And then I'll probably try it in game, maybe get a pinch. Nice, I'll leave it at that. See what the actual speed was 99. Okay, let's try this one then. This one might not be a bad setup. Gonna be honest, that was completely messed up. I don't even know what happened there. But yeah, this is actually a fairly nice setup for ceiling shots. It's just me following it that's the issue. Yeah, that one I was kind of too far. Okay, and then bang it. Kind of close to the actual goal, which kind of makes it difficult. Oh, I tried. I'm getting so close, like, I'm getting the consistent off the ceiling, getting the consistent hit, like, pretty much. It's just the getting it sort of on target or, like, a decent hit, if you know what I mean. That's where I need to improve, you know. Maybe if I make this video again in two years' time, I'll be at that point. But to be honest, if you actually look at my improvement, I'm very much happy with it, like, compared to what I was doing two years ago. And like that, that's a fairly decent ceiling shot, you know. I mean, the setup was kind of fairly easy for that, but, you know, it is what it is. I reckon I'll try some 1v1 games and try and see if I can hit some ceiling shots in them. Okay, guys, might have a setup at the moment. See what we can do. And, of course, he's up for it. Honestly, this guy is, like, super sweaty, I'm going to be honest. Like, I don't even know what is going on with my matchmaking. Really strange. See if I can get another one. What well, might have another one? Let's go. Can we get it? Oh, I messed up the flip. Okay, got another setup on the other side. Gonna grab some boost just to make sure I will be able to continue it. Oh, I feel like that one, I was close. I think this guy's kind of like realized what's going on and he sort of stopped just full on sweating which is kind of nice but yeah see can I get another one here maybe go for like a normal type of one or yeah that one I was kind of too far off is fine don't know what this guy is trying to say because I don't speak that language so yeah he's going for pinches which is decent you know good to see good to see got another setup right now Okay, so this one's off the... Yeah, that's terrible. Don't know what this guy's doing. He's just giving up. I don't even care. Like, I'm not going for goals. I'm just going for ceiling shots. Oh, I messed up the flip again. Like, don't know what is happening with the flip. Like, I keep... Like, it's almost like I'm putting my stick down and it's just not registering it. So, yeah, let's see. I think this guy's going for it as well. I'm not letting him score that. Absolutely not. Okay, got another setup now. Let's see how we get on. Ooh, I mean that was better. I actually got the flip that time. But, yeah, don't know what this guy's going to do. See how he gets on. And he's completely messed that up. Tried to bump me as well. It's fine. Okay, so I reckon let's get a set up off of this point. Okay, double tap, seen in shot, or not. I mean, I'm getting there. Like, this is sort of the closest I've ever really been in a real game. Like, real games, I don't really get them at all. This guy keeps going for, like, pinches and off the ground. Which I suppose is interesting. That's not what I'm going for, I'm just going for anything, so... Yeah. Oh, close one, close one, close. See what he does now. Pretty much game over, so I don't think I'm going to get another chance to ceiling shot. So I hope you guys enjoyed and let me know how you get on with your progress. You know, have you improved like I have? Have you improved more? You know, sort of stuff like that. And yeah, let me know if you'd like to see on Rocket League or any other games you'd like to see on this channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Built